keep your voice down. The lilac Daphne, a Daphne of the genus Themeliaceae, has a strong anti-convulsant effect, can be made into an anesthetic powder. Extrapolating from these two data sets, it would be particularly potent against Piscine species. Hey, make sure you're getting all this down. I told you all to keep your voices low. Plants aren't afraid of noise, but your shouting is making my ears ring. You... you didn't disassemble Karkata? Why would I do that? But... Paimon thought you said, according to the Academia's policies... So that's why you two barged in like barbarians at this hour. Fine, I suppose I wasn't clear enough about this yesterday. What I meant was, according to the Academia's policies, all products of research must be destroyed. That's why we can't let the Academia discover that place. Anyway, the first thing I did was repair Karkata. During my time at the Academia, I took an elective course at the Spantama. Who knew it would prove useful one day? We then buried Abatui together. After organizing the research materials, I kept some as a souvenir. Most of it was burned to hide the evidence. I'm not with the Academia, so what do their policies have to do with me? On the other hand, I am the Forest Watcher of the Avidya Forest. I have a duty to protect all life in the forest. All life brought forth in this world has meaning, and Karkata is no exception. If it exists, then it shouldn't be carelessly abandoned or destroyed. <laughs> The possibility exists, is all. It's hard to explain Karkata's efforts to repair Abatui. Abatui only left behind a small portion of his research. Who knows how many commands he installed. Maybe a conflict between all those commands resulted in this sort of behavior. From a more rigorous perspective, it is impossible to conclude that Karkata is a real life form. But the possibility exists. I am willing to believe in that. By the way, I'm not interested in continuing research on this subject. I'm just letting it hang out here because this place is relatively secluded. But as things stand now, it wouldn't be a bad idea to make it my research assistant. At the very least, it can record my experiments. What do you think? <laughs> hmm. 